Right, I'm at the crossroads here. You can go up there and join all the main tracks up to the forest. That, follow that, that'll take you back up towards uh, Shipham. And you can go this way, there's also a track in there. By the way, there's a track in there. It's just inside there, but it's a bit, it might even be boggy. And then you can follow the stream through the valley. The Robo Fort will be up high. Um, But, um, like I said, I probably won't be doing that. There's no real need to do that unless you're... <sighs> you don't, I don't really need to do it as such. <sighs> it's nice to go up there now and again, but it's only a hill. <sighs> I've already done quite a lot. What I'll probably do today, the fort can be done another time when I come via a different route. <sighs> when I come via... Um, Sanford. That's when I usually do the, that. I was trying to put too much in. Um, I did too big a diversion. Anyway, not to worry about that. We're down here by this beautiful stream. Now, they were doing some work on somebody's house for much further down um, last time I came here. And they later on, they stopped. They sent the stream off at a different angle um, because they didn't want they, want, they were doing a bridge that's what they were doing they were making a bridge to someone's home reinforcing it so they had to divert the stream so it was it could be quite boggy could be quite boggy So this is Sheila in the beautiful Somerset countryside. Um, I've just not long come through um, Tynings Farm with beautiful views over the valley to Steep Home Island. Look at that, isn't it lovely? The magic of music. something. Went right through my t-shirt actually, whatever it was. Horsefly got me through my t-shirt. <sighs> you can always tell when they're on your back. Oh, those horseflies are worse than ticks. <sighs> Christ, I think he'd been on there about 10 minutes. <sighs> Probably have a massive spot there. It took about six months to heal. What's the trouble with them? Look at that though. Nice views. You can hear the water. That is the only risk when you come out you're going to get attacked. A hot body coming along and they all love it. All that blood. A well-fed body. <sighs> Sorry to talk about that. But uh, like I said, if you went in the jungle or anything, you'd have you'd have other animals after you. <sighs> we do them a favour and we feed them when we come in for a while. <sighs> it's always best to keep to the main track if you can, but if you only got a brush of tree and something can get on you see I only did this walk for the first time ever last year down here there are various ways across there's another one on me then just got that one off it's got just another flipping thing I don't know what that was that got me on the elbow oh it's horrible I hate them so there's a, there's a, that leads you up into the wood there, if you went across there now, look. 
locals will know all the ins and outs of all these little walks like I know Western Woods locals over here I mean real locals that come out every day oh god I thought this would happen when I come down here you come down in the flipping streams and you get the midges I didn't put any repellent on oh isn't it lovely though oh, isn't this beautiful beautiful isn't it Yeah, I only discovered this last year. Well, it's always been here, of course, but what I'm saying is I decided to find out where it went. And, yeah, it brings you back to the base of of the fort. This is the water that feeds all the streams. Like I said, it'd be interesting to see if it's still... if it shuts off again like it did before this could all be extreme in the winter look if there was a flood this could all be like a stream this bit what I'm walking on Right, over and out everyone, I'm going to turn off, take some pictures of the stream. <laughs> 